Simon says, subscribe and click on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hello everyone. Welcome to a new tutorial from Simon Says It. In this video, I'll show you how to use the match function in Excel. Excel consists of a variety of functions that help in performing a variety of operations at ease. If you want to find the position of a particular value when using Excel tables or pivot tables, you can use the match function. The main purpose of the match function is that this function is used to search any data in an array of cells and returns the relative position of that particular data. The syntax of the match function takes three arguments. The lookup value, the lookup array, and the match type. The lookup value is a mandatory field. This argument denotes the value you want to search in the array. The lookup array is also a mandatory field. This denotes the data array or the cell range from which you want the function to look for the lookup value. Match type is an optional field and can take only the values negative 1, 0, and 1. This field defines how you want the function to search the lookup value in the lookup array. When the match type argument is 0, the match function searches for and finds the first occurring value in the array exactly equal to the lookup value. When the match type value is negative 1, the function finds the exact or the smallest value greater than or equal to the lookup value. However, when using this match type, make sure the array is sorted in descending order. When the match type is value 1, the match function finds the exact or largest value lesser than or equal to the lookup value. However, the values in the lookup array must be arranged in ascending order. Since this is an optional field, the default value will be 1 even if you mention it in the formula or not. Let us now see how to use the match function in Excel with the match type 0. To find the exact match for the particular value, first, choose a destination cell. Enter the formula equals match and pass the arguments as the value, cell range, and the match type. Press Enter. This gives you the position of the search data. That is all, everyone. The match function can be a very helpful tool that helps you find the relative position of the value. This can help find, replace, or make any changes to the data. In this video, we saw how to use the match function in Excel along with its use cases. Thank you. If you're not a subscriber, click down below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. To see the full blog article that this video came from, please click over there. And click over there to see more videos from Simon Says It.